Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy Axe coming at y'all with a brand new video. This is my second time recording this one, so it's a little tough, but it's all good. If you guys didn't know, we got a new token market update. I don't recommend you go into the token market and actually buy these packs, if I'm being real with you. I don't recommend it. But we got a new Galaxy Opal, two new pink diamonds, and two new diamonds. If you guys want to see the stats of all the cards, go down to the link in the description down below that says stats video and check that out. If you guys want to see a gameplay with the new Galaxy Opal, which is Tony Parker, go down to the Galaxy Opal Tony Parker link and click that and watch it right there. Preferably after this video. If you guys want to see the pink diamond Paul Millsap gameplay, one of the pink diamonds we got, Go click that link down in the description down below as well, and it'll bring you there. And then last but not least, we're on the Pink Diamond Reggie Lewis gameplay right now. This card is amazing. Obviously, I've already played with him, so I know how he rocks. I know what his animations are looking like, and they're beautiful. You see, he had 18 points last time. Pretty good. Uh, that's 11 off and 29 gold. Um, again, I'm not going to show you too much of them because you can go to the stats video. Check them out. I don't want to get you know too in-depth with it for the stats, but I want to show you guys all of his animations and then have fun um, with a game uh, you know obviously that's what we're here for if we're here for a gameplay we're here to have fun with it and rock with it and I'm excited to use this card again obviously I've already used them once um, I forgot to turn off my meter in that gameplay so hopefully we can turn off meter and uh, have a lot of fun but he does go up to a 98 with his coach boost and he'll be a 99 um, with the floor general boost that he's gonna get from uh, Tony Parker because I'm going to be using Tony Parker I do really really like uh, TP I think he's being majorly slept on but now we just got to get used to it so his release um since we're you know talking about the card feels like it literally like rich mitch rich rich mitch richmond i was messing it up i was doing like a rich mitchman that's what i was trying to say it that's that's not how it goes um but it's literally his jumper um i don't know why but i'm not complaining because it's it's butter man like look it's big green uh, if you guys were wondering reggie lewis uh can do the behind the back he can do the hezzy quick shot he can do all that sort of stuff um, he's actually a god, and he's going to be amazing, man. Like, I've already used him, obviously. Um, and we had to get guarded by Pink Diamond Larry Bird last time, and we were still uh, getting big buckets, so it's amazing. And, ooh, if you guys haven't seen it, uh, look at the vert on this Reggie Lewis card, man. Absolutely crazy. I've seen a lot of people call this drop underwhelming, and if you guys are seriously under the opinion that these cards are underwhelming, I think you really need to go and pick these cards up because reggie lewis is a beast he's gonna dunk all over your head shoot like crazy and can still play defense paul Millsap, in my opinion is a top all-around card in the game tony parker is an amazing three and dpg um and then brooke lopez splash mountain like how can you hate it <laughs> um we're gonna go into the gameplay real quick we're gonna have reggie miller tony parker and then paul Millsap. i'm liking the little trio but seriously, I highly recommend checking out the other gameplays. I'm getting a gameplay on everybody that has dropped today besides Isaiah Ryder. Brooke Lopez is dropping after this. So if you guys are a little worried about them, just wait. Check out all the gameplays, all the cards, and then you can make your opinion based off of that and kind of see what you want to do uh, with the cards. I still recommend that you pick some of them up, but again, if you like the look of them or don't like the look of them, that should be, you know, what influences your decision. Don't get something you don't believe in. Alrighty y'all, so here we are again. It's loading into another game. Um, the recording kind of like glitched off, so I'm gonna have a weird like cut point uh, after the intro. I checked out the end of the recording and like after the game started, it got like super laggy. So I'm back here trying to get it again uh, and see what we can do. It looks like we're going against um, Cliff Hagen with Reggie Lewis because I think he's just a little bit taller than Drew Holiday. I think he's just barely taller than Drew Holiday, which is good because I'm pretty sure Cliff Hagen has like no clams, which means it's cook time. He's off balling and has his mic on. That's awesome. Here we go. That's a big green. Come on, you can't leave. Clip. You can't leave him open. Come on, man. From midi to that's big dubbies, big dubbies. Um, looks like he's only talking at certain points. Um, ooh, ooh. Yeah, we're just gonna bring Paul Millsap over to try to stop whatever it is that he uh, is doing. Oh, look at TP with the rebound. Oh, we blotched the pass he threw it straight up instead of bouncing it anything but what he did would have been great and again off balling boom big greens you can't off ball like that man we're just gonna run down snatch back big greens in your mouth come on you can't be doing that everybody that off balls a triple threat honestly it's really it's a lot easier than y'all think um to score on off ball as a triple threat like there's so many like easy ways to just abuse the off ball because the AIs just aren't good at defense. Oh, he's trying to off ball with 
Ugh. Oh, he, I knew the pass was going to happen. I knew it. I could sense it. We're going to call a little screen. I mean, he left us wide open. There's another big green. Come on. What y'all doing? What y'all doing? He took control, and we still splashed it in his mouth. Reggie Lewis is just insane. I want to get some crazy dunks, because uh, in the gameplay that messed up uh, audio-wise, we were getting some wild posters. Here we go. There's one with Reggie Lewis. He's got 10 cooking it up, man. Here we go. All right, he's coming down with the Drew. I don't feel like he can do too much with Drew Holiday. He's only got like a 75-3, so he can hit it wide open, but I don't trust in it too much. Here we go. Yeah, he knew who he was going to, and it bounced off his foot. That's tough. Oh, I knew the oop was coming. I was trying to spam square and get it off, um, but it's fine. If he gets some buckets, I know he's going to stay in um, longer. Sometimes people quit if you know they're down you know, too much. So, that works perfectly with me, especially when we're getting more big greens. Come on, big threes, big greens. That half green machine is amazing, man. Like, I love it. I love it. Oof, the crossover right in the TP. Oh, he went up with that layup, fam. Some of y'all go up with the craziest thing. That's definitely not an open layup by any means, but he still went up with it and still got it. Do a little hop. You're going to leave. Oh, if we're going to early it like that, it's a good decision. But with floor general, Paul Millsap goes up to a 99-3 so leaving Paul Millsap open in the corner is a very bad idea if we kick it like that and get a buck oh my dude this is this is some awful gameplay this is awful not by us but by him here we go another one run by quick little pass over to the dude that he left wide open oh, we slightly late it again he's gonna think it's a good strategy to leave a three-point shooter like that wide open like what is this here we go. Off. Oh. oh. I didn't pass it in time, man. There we go. Ah, oh, Reggie Lewis went in. He still got the dunk, though. There we go. He's got 15 points already. We're cooking. Cooking. Oh, he's going to come in. Eh. Yeah. yeah. We're here. We got you, Andrew. Come on. Come on. TP. He's got defense. Do the fadeaway. Do the little fadeaway. Come on. You can see it. Oh, yeah. Paul Millsap with great defense, man. I love Paul Millsap. That's just like an off ball defender. He plays so well. So, so well. We go. Why did these matchups switch? Hey, TP with the steal, fast break. Reggie Lewis, we're pulling down on a stick to get that crazy dunk. He's got 17 points. Slasher takeover is now active, and we can see what's going on. I just realized now you guys probably can hear what he's saying um, this entire time. I can't um, because I don't have any of my I don't have like my headset on, so I'm just gonna be a fun thing to hear later. Um, so I might even have to. Blurt something out if he goes too crazy. Reverse dunk. Yeah, you didn't see that coming. Big 19 with Reggie Lewis. You can sit there in the paint, but if you're not ready for the reverse dunk, it's over, man. It's over. Slashing takeover on Reggie Lewis is just overpowered. I'm loving it. Slashing takeover period is pretty OP, but on Reggie Lewis, a card that is just this good, man, it is unreal. And we're going to do the same thing. Bah! Finish off the game with Reggie Lewis. I don't even know if he missed. He did one field goal. We have 21 points, one rebound, 9 of 10 from the field, 3 of 3 from 3. What a game by this card. Seriously looking like one of the top cards in the game is Reggie Lewis. He's looking amazing, and I definitely recommend you guys pick him up. Drop a like down below if you guys did enjoy the video and comment what you guys think of this card and any other gameplays you guys want to see. Subscribe if you guys are new on that with a 3.6K. You guys have a great rest of your day, and I will see you all in the next.